September is National Preparedness Month. News 12's Hannah Bullard has tips on emergency preparedness and speaks with a local ecologist about the frequency of natural disasters. The Hamilton County Office of Emergency Management is recognizing September as National Preparedness Month with their A Lasting Legacy campaign. A lasting legacy, a life you'll build uh, is worth protecting, preparing for disasters to create a lasting legacy for you and your family. HCOEM has plenty of tips on disaster preparedness kits, saying it's better to be proactive than reactive. It needs to be at least one gallon of water per person per day for three to five days. Non-perishable food items, dried food, peanut butter crackers, uh, anything that is non-perishable, enough for each person for three to five days. Pet supplies, food and water for your pets. They are part of our family as well. Microbial ecologist Henry Pratt at UTC said due to changes in natural wind streams, we should likely prepare for more natural disaster events. And if you get the wind blowing, for example, coming up off of the Gulf into this part of the southeastern United States, uh, you know, too, in too extreme a way, you're going to end up with much higher levels of rainfall, massive amounts of mo Gulf moisture that are just being pumped up here. Climate change will definitely have an impact on the frequency of these flash flood events. We have to be very careful about our sort of our city planning, how, where we allow development to occur. Uh, if the, the hills have been denuded of vegetation, then you can have landslides. More tips on preparing those emergency kits can be found at HamiltonReady.org. In Chattanooga, Hannah Bullard, News 12 Now.